Dr. Philip May at the UNC Nutrition Research Institute has studied the effects of fetal alcohol syndrome for decades. It is best for the woman to take care of her own health through adequate nutrition, not drinking and ingesting the best quality foods that she can. May, that along with a team of doctors and scientists, traveled to South Africa collecting data and studying school children. A number of facial features that are altered. But really the biggest problem that we're concerned about is the, is the intelligence and the behavior. The team is also studying growth and development of 1,200 students in Cabarrus County and Kannapolis. That includes looking at nutrition and signs of fetal alcohol syndrome. May says cognitive behavior can be altered for life depending on the mother's health. As for pushback from the community regarding the CDC's recommendation to abstain from drinking if not on birth control or trying to conceive. That is the woman's legal right. She is the person who can decide whether to drink or not. However, it is our job as research scientists to publish the results. For May, the key is sharing information to help women make their own decisions. And according to May's studies, nutrition, demographic, drinking, body mass all factor into how alcohol will impact an unborn child. When alcohol is ingested prenatally, it can do lots of damage. Research that May believes shows overall health is important to how a child will develop. In Kannapolis, Carly Stevenson, Time Warner Cable News.